You have a number of awards. Uh, you were a <laughs> number of awards. <laughs> you were a, a prospector, CEO yeah. of company. Yeah. Um, is there one contribution or a set of contributions that you are the most proud of? Yeah, I, I, I think we're probably one of the only groups, uh, certainly one of a, a very small handful who are trying to recreate a company uh, in Canada. O over the course of my career, since I graduated in 1986 from Mount Allison, uh, I've seen the demise of companies that, that you would have thought would have been around forever, uh, like Naranda, uh, Falcon Bridge, Cominco, uh, Inco, uh, all of the, these great long-term huge Canadian corporations just disappearing in a bad market. Uh, you know, for, for a variety of different reasons. Uh, our goal when we started was to actually go out and start a mining company and produce gold. Uh, it, it, it goes back to the, the, the fundamental uh, foundation investors that we had in our group. Um, a lot of the money came out of Germany and from small German families who have a long history of running mm -hmm. small companies for generations in their family. And when a lot of the initial investors wrote, wrote their checks, they said, okay, well, here's my check. Call me in five years or seven years when you're pouring gold. And that was pretty much the extent of it. They, they fully expected that we were going to go out and find a mine and, and go into production. Uh, typically, in our Canadian mining business, probably 95% or better of the companies have no intention of ever being miners. Uh, but we, we were genuine from the beginning about wanting to go out and, and find gold and produce gold. 